Welcome back to another video. And sa video na to, tatalakayin natin kung ano nga ba yung spread operator. So, to simplify things, yung spread operator is ginagamit siya sa mga iterables. So, ano yung example ng mga iterables natin sa JavaScript? So, we have object and array. So, ang ginagawa ng spread operator is in-expand niya yung values sa loob ng mga iterables na yon. So, let's see this one in action. First, ang syntax ng pag-spread is tatlong dot. So, dot, dot, dot. And then, yung iterable mo. So, it can be your person object or your fruits array. No, It can be that way. So, itry natin mag-declare ng variable. So, for example, you will have your const um, body. Okay? So, we'll have our head. And, for example, our knees. Okay? Meron ka ng ganyan. Meron ka ng um, body array. So, what if gusto mo ng complete? So, const complete body. No? And, gusto mo na i-copy yung body parts na nasa body array natin dito sa bago nating array. So, paano natin gagawin yon? So, gagamitin natin ang spread operator sa pag-copy ng mga values. So, we will have, for example, toes and then yung shoulder. So, gamit yung spread operator, dot, 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 and then yung iterable natin, which is yung body. So, save natin, and then, check natin sa console. Log complete body. Okay? And then, run node index.js. And makita nyo na, yung values is toes, shoulder, head, and knee. So, depende kung saan nyo nilagay yung um, spread operator nyo or uh, iterable nyo, dun din malalagay yung value. So, for example, um, sa unahan, no? sa dito, before yung toes. So, pwede rin. But, different na yung results or yung order. So, run. You will have your head, knees first. And then, yung toes. Tapos, lastly, yung shoulder. So, ganito gumamit ng spread operator in arrays. So, let's try another example. Okay, remove natin to. Let's try it in an object. So, parang pare-pareho rin din naman sa mga objects. So, const person. For example, si person. Meron siyang name. Okay, John Do. Okay. Meron siyang age. Okay. A 21, for example. So, what if gusto mong i-copy yung mga values ng person um, into another object? So, for example, const contact person. So, meron ganun. So, gagawin mo lang. For example, may mga objects or value pairs pa dito. So, for example, contact number. Okay, string 0948. Ayan, ganyan-ganyan. Tapos, ang gagawin mo lang, is spread mo lang yung values from the person object. Same dun sa ginawa natin sa itaas, uh, sa array. So, dot, 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 and then yung person object. So, let's see the value. So, console.log contact person. So, clear mo na natin yung console, and then i-run natin yung node index.js. And then, makita niyo na, meron ko ng contact number, my name, and then yung age. So, successful yung pag-spread mo or pag-copy mo ng mga values from this person object to contact person. Okay, so yung last example natin is paano natin gamitin yung spread operator in a function. Okay, so possible din yun na mangyari. So, let's say, you will have um, a constant of numbers, okay? So, it will be an array of numbers. So, example, meron kang 1... 2, 3. Okay. So, ito yung iterable mo. So, try mo natin delete mo sa taas. Okay. And then, we will create a function na mag add ng um, numbers uh, from your array. So, how can we do that? So, for example, you have a function sum. Di ba tatlo yung parameters natin uh, sa ating example? So, meron tang A, B, and C. Okay. So, dito, i-return lang natin. A plus B plus C. Okay. And then, ilalag natin yung values. So, tawagin natin sa console.log. And then, yung function. So, sum. So, pag hindi ka gumamit ng spread operator, uh, yung mangyari is ganito. Um, pwede mo siyang i-access one by one since alam mo yung values. So, numbers, zero. So, access mo siya by index, di ba? Numbers, one. Or numbers, three. So, pag nakita mo na kasi na tatlo yung um, value sa array mo. So, gagana rin naman to. So, node index.js. 
So, NAN. So, bakit naging NAN yung sagot natin? Kasi, wala yung number 3. Dapat number 2 to. <laughs> okay. So, if nakatch nyo yun, good. So, ayan, may number 6 yung sagot. So, 1 plus 2 is 3. So, 3 plus 3 is 6. And there is another way, or much faster way to do this. You can use the spread operator here. Okay. Dot, 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 numbers. Okay. So, run. You will have the same answer. So, that is how you use a spread operator as a parameter sa function natin. So, I hope may natutunan kayo. And sa next videos natin, pag-usapan pa natin yung mga dapat nyong matutunan uh, before moving to React. Maraming salamat.